Hello, hello, hello! It's Thursday! Guess what that means? Hey, hey, hey! Hi guys! How are you doing? Can't believe it's Thursday already! Whoa! Alright! So... How is everyone doing? Okay. So, I um, showed you guys these um, rails I got at Wreath Makers Live from Wood Ideas by Door. Hey, Lynn. Hey, Mary Ellen. Hey, Barbara. So, this is the one you guys wanted me to make. Um, isn't it cute? Look at that. Merry Christmas. So, what it is is it's actually a metal sign put on to um, one of her rails. So, this is the one you guys picked for me to make. Um, so what I do is I, bring this down a little bit, I kind of find the center. Hey Audrey, thank you. Hello Nicole, hey Christy. I kind of find the center and I put the first one there and then I go to each end and I put one there and then I kind of space them out in the middle so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take a little glue you guys like my new glue gun holder I got it from Susie Brown at Wreath Makers Live it's awesome I love it I love it I love it if you don't have one you guys need to get one Okay, so, um, yeah, if you guys haven't seen this, it's Susie's new um, glue gun holder, and I love it. I got my box in. Hello, everyone. So, um, I just wanted to show this to you guys real quick while that's drying a little bit. So, what it is, which I love, she's so wonderful, it's um, a little stand, and it has this ceramic, um, you know, little piece here. And then the glue, if you have a drip, will drip onto here. So I love it. Now, you can use it, hey, tequila! You can use it for a regular one, like with a, um, with a cord if you want to. But this one fits perfectly on here. It's great. It kind of, I like that it kind of sits on the edge a little bit. And thank you, Bev. I'm glad to be back. And then it drips right here. So I love it. They are $25. They're awesome. They have the little um, non-stick grip pads on here, which I love. So I think it's great. Hey, Joy. So I had to share that with you guys. So if you guys need a glue gun or anything like that, make sure you go grab it from Miss Susie Bram. So let me, um, I have that. And let me see for the mesh roller. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pin this with um, the information for the sign. Okay, so the rail I got at um, Wood Ideas by Door. At least that's what she used to call it. Now she calls it something else. But I put it, I pinned, I put it there and that is the number so you just go onto her facebook group there it's a free group and they just tell her you want to order um number 148 and please tell her that you um i did bev um tell her you want to order one and um that you saw it on here yes so i did go to sam's and look at this truck ribbon, you guys. Oh, my stars. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? For like seven bucks. Yay! So we're going to use the Sam's ribbon. We're going to use that, but I love this. I just think this is so stinking cute. Alright, so I'm going to put this to the side. And get our mesh ready okay so what I'm going to do is I have this um, kind of fabric oh it's kind of stuck to itself fabric mesh 
that I got and I'm going to cut this to, yes, I went to Sam's yesterday, about, let's do 21 inches. Okay, thank you for blessing me. I really appreciate it. That's awesome. So I need five of them. You didn't have any, I know, I called uh, one of them and they didn't have it and then I called the other one because both of them both of mine are about an hour an hour and a half away so I called before I went because I don't want to drive an hour an hour and a half and then get there and tell me that they don't have it oh great Sandra so this I love this mesh I love this mesh I love this mesh I got it from Tommy's Wholesale when I was in Myrtle Beach, they have in um, Florence, and I got a bunch of rolls of this because I just love it, and they hit great prices. So, oh, I know it's crazy. Like I said, one of the um, one of the Sam's Club that I that's you know an hour from me did not have it out, so I called the other one that's like an hour from me the other way, and they had theirs out. So, and it seems like they have theirs out um, all the time. Hey, Deb, how are you feeling? Yes, and Costco has theirs out. So, make sure you check out Costco. I have to show you the cute ribbon I found at top Costco. All right, so we're going to do ruffles. You guys know I love my ruffles. And I will show you, remind me, don't let me forget to show you um, the Costco ribbon because it's really cute. Hey Connie! Hey Renee! Alright, so what I do is I just tuck about an inch under just so I don't have the frayed edge showing and then you want to try to keep your ruffle as even as possible. So you want to really try and keep it down the center and then oh I know they only had two crates full at mine too Barbara I saw someone else that said they had four there. Well, mine only had two. And they only had three rolls of the truck ribbon. And I'm like, I am snatching that up. So I did, I bought three. Hey, Alex, how are you? So don't forget to bless my page if you would, please. Please, please, please. So I got my box today that I had, um my friend Johnny ship from Wreath Makers Live. So I'll have to show you guys some of the other stuff I got there too. The swag bag and, um, hey Linda, how's it going? Okay, so what's nice about the rails is yes, the rails are a little more expensive than a typical sign, that kind of thing, but you really don't use a ton of material on them. Thank you, Mary Ellen, much, much appreciated. So, um, you know, they usually cost about the same as a wreath by the time you get done. Hey, Connie. Right, so isn't that pretty? Love that. I love this black and red mesh. I think, I don't remember. Yeah, it just depends where you are. Like I said, the one store um, in Temple, Pennsylvania has it, but the store in Willow Grove does not. Hey, Elizabeth. So I think it really just depends. Hey, Terry on the store because last year it was the same way the Willow Grove store did not have any but the Temple one did so and I'd rather run up to the Temple one anyway because um, it's less traffic that way I got it it's the um, Connie it's pinned I got it from Doors Wood Ideas I have it pinned there in the comments and you can just um, click on her Facebook group and I gave you the real number so all you have to do is tell her the number of the rail, and um, you can order it from her. So, and just tell her that, you know, you saw it on my page, if you would, please. I know, these rails are so cute. I bought a ton of her rails. I did the um, Happy Fall Y'all one um, in my group the other night, so I'll show you that one to you guys, too. Oh, I know, they're adorable. It's called a rail. Um, it's called, yeah, it's called a rail and it has a sign with it. 
And for those of you who have not, who have not seen them, I love them. They're just adorable. Hey, Dawn. So I'll show you what they look like. I think I have one back here. Maybe not. Um, but I bought a bunch of them. Oh, they do? Okay. All right. So that's the mesh. Okay. Pull you guys up a little bit. So this is the one I made the other night in my group. It is a fall one. Isn't that pretty? Love it. My private group is $14.99 a month. And, oh, here's another one. You guys are welcome to join. I would love to have you. Okay, so this is what the, um, I know I love it. Okay, so this is another one. Now this is a straight rail, okay? This one has a curve to it, which I love that too, okay? So this one is a straight one. And what these are is they're metal signs on top of the wooden rail. Like a lot of the ones um, you've seen before, they're all wood. But um, this is a metal sign on top of a wood. How wide is the bottom of the one I'm using? So from corner to corner, it's about 19 inches. So from here to here, it's about 19 inches. And then from top to bottom, it's 15 inches. Um, Jennifer, I have it pinned. It says the Merry Christmas rail number 148 by Doors Wood Ideas. And then there's a link right to her um, Facebook page. And you can just go and tell her that you want um, rail number 148. Okay. All right. So isn't that so stinking cute? I love it. All right. So then I have... I got this, you guys, in my um, Wreath Makers Live swag bag. Don't you love it? It's the perfect buffalo plaid. I'm going to use that. And then, of course, I'm going to use my um, ribbon from Sam's. So let's cut some of that. No problem. I think I already... All right, I'm going to... I don't remember if I wanted 12 inches or 10 inches. So let's cut one and see. Yeah, the sign is from Wood Idea, or she used to be called Wood Ideas by Door, but she changed her name. So, um, it's right there in the pinned comment. And also the glue gun, my new glue gun holder, which I love. This I cut 12 inches. Yep, I think that's going to be good. Alright, so let me put this back here. Whoops. While I cut some more. Hey, Johnny. Speaking of which, I was just talking about you, how you shipped my stuff to me. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, one more. Um, this is from Michael's. I'll tell you, if I had a dime, if I had an affiliate link for Michael's, I'd be rich. Yeah, this is from Michael's. Love it. That's what Michaels needs to do, is have an affiliate link. I did, Johnny. I did, I did, I did. So I got all my stuff. I did, I got it. Was it yesterday? Today? I don't even remember. I think it was, it was today. It was today. Yes, it was today. And then I will cut this. One three, four, and five. Okay. And I want to show you guys, since Johnny's on here, look at this. See these little bees? Aren't these adorable? So, Miss Johnny Lynn gave those to me, and um, I've been using different ones, but these are little tiny ones. You are, all right, girl, make sure you tell, remind me. Um, so I'm gonna hide one in, in every one of my wreaths and stuff that I make. 
Okay, so I'm just dovetailing the ends. Yeah, that is. Yeah, Melissa, that um, the truck ribbon is from Sam's. Now this is not. This I got in my swag bag at Wreath Makers Live and it is beautiful. I love it. Yeah, I bought I went and I I bought way too many rolls yesterday, you guys, but you know. That's okay. But you know, for seven dollars for fifty yard roll, you don't find that. So I ran up there as soon as I called and they said that they had it um, and I got a bunch of rolls okay so I'm just going to place that on the top fold it in half and gather it together and put it in here I know it's crazy right crazy and then I also have um, some mesh tubing I thought we'd use too now you can do um, bows on this 25 oh I know right I bought a lot more than that they didn't have the truck well I'll tell you they have oh sure um, they only had three rolls and I bought all three rolls and as soon as the other Sam says they have their ribbon put out which is usually later than this one I'm gonna go get more okay this is what the back of it looks like so it's a wooden rail okay and then oh thank you Melissa I am using the um, uh, pipe cleaners And like I said, you can also, um, you know, if you want to just do bows on top of this, you can do bows. And this is really a nice ribbon. It's kind of fuzzy. Love that ribbon. Love it, love it, love it. So what are you guys doing exciting this weekend? Anything fun? Yeah, I know. I, I thought about doing the bows too, but I kind of really want to see them mesh. So um, that's why I didn't. So yeah, the new glue gun holders, I love them. Oh, Pam, it was so nice meeting you too. Pam um, met us, Kathy and I, down at um, Carolina Pottery in Myrtle Beach. Oh, Pam, I'm so glad you came over. I did a live, and she was like, oh, I'm going to come over in an hour. And I'm like, girl, you better come over now. I'm like, we're not going to be here in an hour. Come now, come now. So she came over, and it was so much fun. You got the cricket? Oh, yay! I know, I just got mine. Family reunion, fun. We're having a game night with some friends. But family reunions are fun. The rails, I have it pinned. I have it in the pinned post. It came from Doors Wood Ideas. So if you just click on that, it'll show you, um, or you, it'll take you right to her page, and it's rail number 148. And just please tell her that you saw it on here. Bev, I'm so going to do some Cricut stuff on here. I did, um, I did one when I first got mine. I got it right before I left for vacation. And I made a couple signs live here, so, and I can't wait to, I can't wait to, um, play with it some more. This is a fabric mesh that I got from, um, the Tommy's Wholesale. I love this black and, black and white, uh, black and red. All right, now, I don't know, I kind of like it, but what I did was I cut black, red, and white because I wanted to add a little bit of white because of the sign. Oh, three hours from Myrtle Beach. Awesome. I cut these about 20, 21 inches. Nothing, nothing, you know, crazy. And then I'm just going to fold them in half. And I don't know, I think folding them in half again will be too much. So, I don't know. Yes, um, they came from Doors Wood IDs, 
and um, it's pinned right there in the comments. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fold them like this and make a little bow with them because what I normally do is I fold them in half and then in half again, but I didn't like the way that looked. So I'm going to fold it in half so it kind of overlaps a little bit and then do like that and then put them in, put them all in together because I kind of want, I want that truck ribbon to show. Okay. Okay, so it looks like that. So like I said, I wanted to bring, thank you Tequila, I wanted to bring a little bit of the white in from the sign. So again, I cut these about 20, 21 inches. I'm gonna fold it over so it overlaps a little bit and then do that. And then again, fold it over and over again. And I'm not putting these in any particular order. You can put them in any order that you want. Okay, and then I'm putting them up and down. I'm not putting them side to side because I don't want it to compete with the um, truck ribbon. Okay, so it's just kind of jazzing it up a little bit. And then I kind of want to add something in the middle there. I think, I think, I think, I think, I think I might add something else. Okay, so again, I'm just taking it, folding it. I know, I love it too. I love these rails. And just gathering it. And it doesn't matter if they're the same size loop or anything. It's just to kind of jazz it up. If one's smaller, one's bigger, it's okay. All right. Yeah, I kind of, I wanted to lighten up because everything's so dark. So I wanted to bring in some white from the sign. So again, I'm just taking it and just overlapping it so it doesn't come undone. I think I need one more red. Okay, and like I said, it doesn't matter if they're the same size. I'm not worrying about it. And then I'm putting them in like this. Thank you, Carol. Hey, Christina, how are you? Okay, and then I need one more red. Oh, I know. I just love them. I thought they were so pretty. I bought a bunch of them. And I like the, the round ones. You know, the kind of circular ones. Okay, so again, I'm going to fold it over. Get the black one. Um, the truck ribbon came from Sam's. And the um, buffalo plaid I got in my swag bag. Hey, Kayla! At um, Wreath Makers Live. Okay, now I kind of am thinking that it needs something else in the middle, like right here, right? So, hey, Kayla! Hey, um, Gail! So what I'm wondering is, and I don't know if this is going to work, but I think I might use one of these. So let's try one of the green, or one of the red, and one of the white, and just see which one we like better. So I don't want them to be big, but I'm going to kind of make, this is from Sam's last year. Oh, I got three, girlfriend. I got three. So, I'm going to cut it 12 inches. Oh, it came undone. It sure did. Thank you. And I'm just going to see which one we like better. And this is from Costco last year. Love my Costco and Sam's ribbon. Put that over here. Yep, it, it escaped. It escaped. So just tie that puppy back in there. 
Okay. Alright, so what I'm thinking, and I don't know, I'm just going to kind of do one of those faux bows, and I don't want it to be big, but I kind of think it needs something in the middle to kind of jazz it up a little bit. So let's try a white one and see if we like it. See, because I want, I still want that truck ribbon to show. And let's try a red one. And this is kind of, I know, right? And this is kind of, um, brings out the Christmas balls on the Christmas tree. Hey, Janet. But I'm kind of thinking, okay, so can you guys see that? Let me zoom you in a little bit. Hey, Steven, how are you? All right. So this one has the white. Can you see that? Oop, let me bring it down. This one has the white. Okay. And this one has the red. But I'm thinking the red blends in too much. What do you guys think? The red or the white? And I'm actually thinking I may add, hold oh, please. You like the white? I like the white too. All right, did I turn that off? All right, let me get my glue gun again. Okay. I think so too. I think the white wins also because the red blends in too much. So, and like I said, I don't want them huge because I still want the, um, truck ribbon to show. There we go. Couldn't get that one in. Or, ooh, 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 so many possibilities. No, I don't want that. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so we're going to do the 12 inches. I'm doing this all backwards. Put this back in here. all of those and like I said you don't use a ton of material doing the rails but they're so pretty oh no Steven yes I did um Steven 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 that's terrible the rail came from um hey Dora I need a drink. Sorry, guys. The rail came from Doors Wood Ideas. And I have it pinned in the comments so that you guys can go ahead and find it. No alert. I, Dora, I'm really beginning to hate mini chat. Okay, so what I do with the mini bows, scoot out a little bit. I just take it, I cut it 12 inches, I overlap them a little bit, and then I fold it down. Now you can make these bigger or smaller, but I kind of wanted them smaller because I don't want them to cover the red truck ribbon. I just kind of want them to accent. You mean how much would I sell it for? Would probably sell it for about $70, $75. Steven, you poor thing. You have been through the ringer. I was just going to ask you if your back was any better. Okay, so. Kind of want that red truck ribbon out there. Now, I'm not cutting off the pipe cleaners or um, tucking them in because I'm going to add these little Christmas, these little foam ball fillers. Hey Harless, how are you? To the um, pipe cleaners. And I want them to kind of stick up a little bit so that 
You could also do, if you look at the tree, it has little candy canes on it. So you could put candy canes in there. But I am going to do the balls. Okay, so again, I just cut these 12 inches. Now, if you want these little bows to be bigger, you just cut your ribbon longer. Okay, and this just gives it a little sparkle because you know Christmas has to have sparkle, you guys. Okay, all right. So that's what it looks like. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these um, I don't know, red, black, white balls. Okay. And what I'm going to do is I'm going, I don't want to leave these real long. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm going to cut them down a little bit. So I need my wire cutters and my, yes, they do. And then, um, oh, hey, Ann from Philadelphia. And then my little um, thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut them down a little bit. So just a little bit is sticking out. Okay. And then I'm going to take my ice pick and make a hole in there. And that's up too much. Okay. And then I'm going to put glue in that. And then I'm going to stick it right on the, I'm going to stick it right on there. And I'm just going to put it on one. I was going to put it on two, but no. Oh, Steven, you poor thing. All right, so I'm going to put a red one there. Okay, cut that one down a little bit. Let's take a black one. Okay, and I'm just putting that hole in there because I want to fill it up with glue so I can put it right on that and kind of make it go in there. All right, and the next one we're going to do red. So I'm going to cut one of the sides off completely and the other one is going to stick up. Okay. Um, these you can get, I got these at either AC Moore, Hobby Lobby, or Michaels. Some places, um, they call them jar fillers, but you can get them pretty much anywhere. Oh, I know, that is terrible. I can't even imagine what those people are going through. I mean, really, what is our country coming to? All these shootings and, ugh, it's crazy. I know, I love these little balls. Yeah, but you can get them, like, they have Halloween ones, you know, Halloween colored ones at Halloween. They have these for Christmas. Hey, Christine. All right, so I need a black one. And they come in all different sizes. I'll show you the, um... But I buy them at the end of the year when they're on sale and I just stock up on them because one bag has a bunch of these little tiny balls in it and they go a long way. Thanks, Harless. All right. Okay, last one here. Oops, I'm going to cut that one too short, but that's okay. All right. And again, I'm just putting a hole in it so I can fill that with glue. My gosh, I love that new glue gun holder. Okay. All right. Oh, I just made this rail. Okay, so this is what they look like. Now, this is a bunch of different ones I'll put together. They come in gold, silver, white. They come in different sizes, like here's a small one, bigger ones. Um, some of them have these little trees on them. You, know, you could put those on there. 
um, but they come in all different sizes. So what I do is I just put them all in a box, in a bag, in, a, in this container. And this is what I use, like for my ribbon flowers and all kinds of stuff. All right. So then, to hang it, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this. Um, now you can use ribbon or you can use um, really anything you want string, whatever. I'm going to use my um, buffalo plaid ribbon. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to kind of roll it up so hopefully I can get it in that little hole because it does come with holes right here. Okay, so I'm going to put it through there. Hopefully it will go. If not, we might have to use a different um, different idea. It might be too thick. Let me try cutting it at an angle first. And feeding it through like that. Oh, that'll do it. Okay, so I just cut it at an angle so I could get it through. Um, I think they were like 20 or $22. All right, so then I'm just going to tie a knot in it. Okay, and then I'm just going to take it. Oh, you're going to Sims Pottery? Whoop, whoop, you're going to love it. All right, and I'm going to see how long I kind of want it. You're going to love it. So you're going to go to the Sims in North Carolina? Oh, awesome. Hey, Ann. I know, they're having an event in September, and I really would love to go, but just can't. I spent too much money. <laughs> too much money at Wreath Makers Live. And so I kind of have to scale it back a little bit. Okay. So what I did was to get it through there, it was kind of thick to go through all at once. So I just angled the ribbon. See the, the edges of the ribbon like that. And then I just fed the point through. Okay. So you kind of want to decide how long you want it. Hey, Kathy! All right. Now, this one, I put a bow on the top. This one, I don't think I'm going to put a bow. I don't want to take away from it. So, kind of, I think that's long enough. Let's see. Oh, you're only three hours from Sims, girl. You know you're going to go and spend a lot of money. All right. So, maybe bring it in just a little bit more. All right. And then, again, I just take it around and tie knots in it. The sign came from Doors Wood Idea. I have it pinned in the comments. Okay. And then I will cut that off. Now, like I said, you can make a bow for, for the top also. But honestly, it I don't think it needs it. I think it's really cute, just plain like this. Now this one, um, okay, and then let me show you the other one I did in my group last or Tuesday night. So this is the fall one, and this one I did put a bow on the top. Oh, no problem. So this one was a straight rail on the bottom, okay. And then I just use the ribbon to hang it. And you have the bow there. Okay, and then this one, I'm not gonna put a bow on. But look at that, I just love them. I love these rails, I really do, they're so pretty. And it's something different. Um, yeah, I'll show you the back, Ursula, let me show you. So this is what it looks like. Hold on. Thank you, thank you. Alright. So this is what they look like. Just to the side. I know, I love the truck. Love it, love it, love it. 
Oh, thanks, Stephen. Okay, so. Now this is a straight one. Okay. So this is what it looks like on the back. Okay, you put your pipe cleaners through here. All right, and then the sign's on here, and she has holes. And then you put your mesh and your um, ribbon and stuff here. I got it from uh, Doors Wood Ideas. Okay, so that's those. And then I did, um, in my group the other night, what I did, uh, or not the other night, but before I left, what I showed them two was, let me show it to you guys, I took a, you can't see, oh, okay, so I took a plain rail, okay, it's just like that, it's just a wood one, right, okay, so I took that, let me bring you guys down a little bit, sorry, okay, I spray painted it black, and then I made different, um, I made different things, bring it down here, so that you can switch them out. So this is the fall one, right? It has the fall, sorry. Okay, and then what you can do is undo the pipe cleaners. So I taught them how to do this in my group. Okay, so that's for fall. So you wanna keep the same rail, then you just put the Halloween part on it. Okay, so now it says hello, same rail. You're just using a, um, now it has the ghost on it. And then, when that's over, and you want to do a Christmas, here's the Christmas rail. So it's interchangeable, right? But you have the same rail, you can just switch out this part. Okay, so they get the same rail they can use and you can switch this part out every season, right? So that's another way um, that you can use rails. Now obviously the Christmas ones and that kind of stuff you're going to keep the same, but this one, um, right, you're getting a repeat customer, right? They pick out this, they pick out the color, whatever they want. Um, I mean you can get the, the rail that says hello, welcome, USA, you know, or anything like that. So um, then I just, you know, made the different seasons and put them on. The seasonal ones, so the back, it's just on a um, stick. So you can just switch them out for different seasons. And like I said, I just spray painted this black. You can spray paint them red, white, whatever color you want, right? You can use whatever you want. Um, but, I, you know, like I said, you can get these. Um, they come, you know, you can get them painted or unpainted. You know, you can get them to say really anything you want them to say. Hello, welcome, you know, anything like that. And then you just switch them out. So, and then that way they can reuse this but, um, you know, switch it out for one that's just, you know, a regular one. And like I said, then you have, you know, the specialty ones that are the, you know, different ones like that. But I just love these with the rounded, with the circular. The rail came from, right, or you can use Velcro, you can use magnets. I mean, there's all kinds of things that you can do to attach them. I just used the pipe cleaners and then you just tie it tie it on you know tie the different rails on so that's all right so you can do all kinds of things like that but um, you know and this one has holes here to put you know your ribbon or however you want to um, however you want to attach it but yeah so that's it the me it's just on um, with pipe cleaners. So I showed my group how to do that. So they learned how to do the interchangeable one. And that's it. Oh, guys, I have to show you the Costco ribbon. Have you guys seen the Costco ribbon yet? Have you seen that yet? I just bought a couple rolls. I didn't buy a ton this year because um, I had a lot from last year.
this is what we got from Costco. I know you guys have all seen the Sam's room in them, right? Um, but this is um, from Costco. So this is a really pretty blue that you can use for any season. I thought this would be great for summer. Like in, um, oh, you didn't, Cheryl? Ugh. Um, you know, your like fish wreaths or, or like, you know, water wreaths, anything like that. Um, I got it from Crazy Chicken Lady. And then this is, look how pretty this is. Let me see if I can pull this out. But this is new from Costco. Yes, make sure you post it, Johnny. Okay, isn't that pretty? Look how pretty that is. Sparkly. And then this one is new this year. It's the red with the gold and the um, red. Yes, they had, um, what did I do with that? They had a couple, not a lot, Darlene. They really didn't have a lot. Let me see which, the only real fall one that I got, um, This was really the only fall one that they had. This is 50 yard rolls. Pat, I was just there, they had it at Costco. Remember when I was down there, they had it. Now this one they had last year, which you guys know, I was in love with this one from last year. Um, so this is from last year and it's a one and a half inch. And so this one kind of coordinates with it. And this is the new one for this one for this year, um, it's two and a half inch. But look, they really didn't have a lot of fall. This was really the only fall one that they kind of had that I'm remembering. So, but look how pretty that is. It's got the shimmery red and gold. They were $6.98, but with tax, by the time I pay tax and everything, like it cost me like $7.41. Pat, remember, I saw it the other day when I was there because I posted a picture of it. It's there, Pat. Okay, and then this one, look how pretty this one is. Okay, isn't that pretty? Now this one's a little sheer. I'm not, I'm not a big um, sheer person, but I really liked the print on this. The rail came from Doors Wood Ideas. It's pinned in the comments. Now this one, you guys, I am in love with this one. It's red and gray. Look how pretty this is. Look at that. Oh, I just love that one. You saw it there, Pat? See? Okay. But look how pretty that is. Oh, my stars. I love the red and the gray. Yes, I'm not a big fan of sheer. I just don't like sheer. But I really liked the pattern on it. But really, this is the only ones I bought at Costco this year. I didn't buy a ton of them because, right, it's good for Valentine's Day. It's good for anything. They might have moved it because sometimes they put it up. You know. But, um, yeah, this is the... But this is the fall one. But isn't that pretty? Oh, in love with that. Hey, Lisa! Lisa! I'm doing my hands. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm telling you, and you, you should go now because, you know, they start to get sold out of this stuff. Now, my Sam's, I, you know, my closest Sam's is either way like an hour um, one way or another. So my Sam's, I kind of have to plan the trip. So that's why I always call them to make sure that they have their their ribbon in because like I said, the Willow Grove one always puts theirs in late. The Temple one usually has theirs first. So I drove up to Temple um, and, got, and got the Costco ribbon or the Sam's ribbon. But I was surprised they had this truck ribbon 
Love it, love it. Okay, where's my mouse? So I'm catching up on them. Yeah, you do. I know, I love the fall plaid. The interchangeable rail came from the crazy chicken lady. Um, but you guys know I was in love with this ribbon last year. And when I saw this this year, oh, hey, Dixie, how are you? Did, they didn't, did you go to your Sam's, Lisa? I know, I thought you were going today. They didn't have it. I'm going to go to the other one when they get it in. And hopefully they have more because I'm going to buy as many as I can find. Because you guys know how expensive that is. I mean, I bought this roll from somewhere and it was $6.59 for a 10 yard roll. And you get, you know, 50 yards. Yeah, no, this was at um, Sam's, Kathy. The truck ribbon was at Sam's. And you guys, the only reason I have a Sam's card is because um, for the ribbon. Waterman's Loft for the truck ribbon. Oh yeah, but I mean, I mean, I like I said, I bought this, and it's not even as pretty. Like, look at it's not even as pretty. And it was, um, you know, six six nine six fifty nine for ten yards, and this was six ninety eight. Uh, Kathy, I am Kathy. If you want some, let me know, and I'll run to Sam's for you, and I'll give it to you in October, or we can go. On a, well, they might not have it then. Let me know. I'll call you. But look, yeah, look how pretty that is. So, all right, guys, that's all for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for spreading the love. And I am on every Monday and Thursday. Hey, Dorothy. I'm on every Monday and Thursday night at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And then I'm in my group on Tuesday nights. And I'm thinking... Yeah, I think it does cost a little more. Um, they sold out already. Yeah, see, you got to go. You got to go as soon as you see it because it sells out quick. Um, but yeah, so I as soon as I as soon as I hear that it's out, I go. I call, and I um, like the one in Willow Grove. Like last year, I think they they were like ready to kill me because I literally like called them every day. Is the ribbon out yet? Is the ribbon out yet? Is the ribbon out yet? They're probably like, just put the ribbon out to shut this girl up because I was calling them every day. So I need an inside person. I need someone that works there to let me know. Thanks, guys. Have a wonderful evening, and I will talk to you later, and I will see you Monday night. Thanks, guys. Bye.